Well, hi everybody. The Billabong Aussie Diner. Burgers, hot dogs, tacos, and uh, chicken kebab wraps. So, menus will be ready. We're open now from 11 until uh, 9 at night till 9 p.m. Uh, this video will probably go up on the YouTube channel in the next uh, couple of days. I'll go through the whole progress of uh, renting the store, renovating the store, getting staff, you know, all those sort of things. So, uh, really hoping it's going to be a success. I think it will be, even though the Rona has uh, the amount of people around this area down somewhat at the moment. Uh, I think we'll still get some local customers once the word gets around about the incredibly delicious Aussie burgers with beetroot. Okay, so I'll give you a look at the shop. So, this is the beginning of Billabong Aussie Diner. This is the shop I'm renting. I have someone whose name, the license and the restaurant is going to be in and uh, I've already got a couple of girls to come and work here. I've got some people coming in to clean up tomorrow. I've got an electrician coming in to put the power on and uh, a new circuit breaker board. Do the lighting. I envision it will be walked through. Top half or so of this wall will be taken out. That'll be an open uh, with a counter coming out about 30 centimetres from the where the wall, existing wall is now, and about 30 centimetres inside. Uh, underneath that counter will be the cooktop for the burgers. Uh, next to that will be the uh, cooktop for the. Uh, bowl with the hot dogs on a stainless steel table that will also have uh, the hot pot for the tacos. Uh, I'll probably put some sort of something on the windows there of course all that, all that signage about tattoos and everything will be gone. This will get painted and be gone. Uh, I'll probably put some timber shelving on that uh, cupboard affair there and this one here timber shelving to put some things in. Uh, that's going to be fixed up along here. All the gaps and everything will be fixed up. I think I'll probably uh, retile the floor. Probably retile the floor. Make a nice tube, black and white checks, and I'll do that from out the front all the way through here. Over where this mirror is, I envision stickers and that going all over that mirror, but uh, probably about this height here. Somewhere will be uh, a bench coming out about uh, 40 centimetres with I think, uh, let me have a look here, one, two, three, four, five, five or six stools. I'll set up uh, two tables here with chairs, plastic tables and chairs. And um, this stuff here belongs to the next door, that'll be moved. I assume the plants are theirs, they'll move back up against here as this will be open. Uh, this grating sliding door I'm going to enclose with something so that if it's uh, really high wind and rain that'll block that out. All this will be fixed and sealed off. I'm going to put a ceiling in from here, straight across here and seal this completely right to here. That can go, that mirror. Uh, got another slider in here that I can use to lock up at night time, even though that door can lock at night time. I want to keep cats and dogs out and stuff like that. Yeah, so this is the beginning. This is what it looks like now. I'm going to get him to clean it right up, get the electrician to come in and uh, do his stuff and do some, he's going to, the same guy's going to do some plumbing because uh, in this section here, up against the back wall, like going outside, I'm gonna have a sink, a double sink, and I'll probably put a hot water system in. 
I'm gonna put a big exhaust fan where that hole is. I may leave that small one there. And um, yeah, and I'm gonna put a, um, uh, an oscillating fan up there in that section so that the girls uh, don't get too hot. I'm gonna put an oscillating fan up there for customers eating in here. I'm going to put uh, an oscillating fan somewhere here or there. That stuff will go. I might just, uh, I might get a couple of pot plants, climbing pot plants, and have some nice vine come up over here, over this, just to uh, make it nicer. All this will get painted as well. Some LED lighting. Uh, I'm not sure what I'll do here. Maybe I'll cover it and maybe I won't, but uh, maybe I will. Maybe I'll get a couple of pot plants with some climbing vines here too. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, yeah. So yeah, this is the beginning. This is what it's gonna be. It's gonna be the Billabong Aussie Diner. Burgers, tacos, hot dogs. So that's it just been in here measuring up to see all the stuff I've got to buy. Yeah, so the landlord owns this hotel over here. So this is right in the bar street of Chat Arm. It's called Bus Station, Bus Station Road. All the bars are up and down here. So I envisage, envisage uh, getting quite a few uh, customers from the bars. And uh, also, this is right in the middle of Bus Station Road, so I envision also getting some customers from Ian's Red Line and a couple of the other bars down here. Quite a few foreigners come here, people that want that kind of foreigners, Western food, especially when they're drinking beer. So hopefully it goes okay. Some progress. I took the tattoo sign off the front window. Uh, had all that boxed in so that the uh, electrical cables are unseen. Power point's going to be for something out the front here. Uh, that's been fixed up a little bit. We put some kind of sign there with different lighting. This wall's going out. Ripped out the rotten old wall there. I'm gonna put fibro wall in there and paint it. Uh, that's from the yellow and red, that'll be taken out, that'll be open. That'll all be painted white in here. Gonna have kitchen sink there, stainless steel table, grill will go here, freezers, racks. Yep, starting to come together. Pretty sure he's gonna jip rock the front top of that for me and block close it all off. This will be jip rocked as well and have new lighting. This will be painted. Probably have a drinks fridge here somewhere. I just put this awning on yesterday. It's gotta be fixed up. It's not really installed all that well, but gives a bit of shade here. So the mirror's gone off the wall, of course. It shattered the pieces, plenty of rubbish. Yeah, there's some work to do, but it's a work in progress, and uh, we will uh, see how we out, go. getting there. Soon we'll be putting the kitchen in here. That opens it up, makes it a lot cooler for the girls working in here, a lot better airflow. They'll be looking out there. Should be good. So the guys have come and cut the signs off to take them away, one for the front, one for the back, and uh, put my signage on them. Uh, the place has been cleaned up a little bit, some uh, 
carpentry building work done. That was boxed in because the electrical cables are hidden away in there. That's been closed off so I can put a sign on it because it was like that. Probably put some plants there, but there's progress happening. That uh, mirror's been taken off the wall there and the wall replaced. Gonna have a bench along there with some chairs. Uh, the counter's in, not completed yet. Uh, exhaust fan, second exhaust fan, hot water heater. That's gonna be painted. Uh, the floors have got to be tiled yet. I can't get any of my equipment in until the floors are painted, uh, tiled. So I'm going to have ceramics right along the front here. And right through the shop there. And uh, in the kitchen area. I'll have some tables and chairs out on that front veranda. I've had this awning put up. So I've got a bit of space here for a little bit of parking. I'm gonna put some plants around the outside of it and across the front here. Uh, the awning's up, it rained last night and it collapsed, so I've just had them come back and fix it. A little bit better than their original job. Yeah, so there'll be a big sign, a canvas type sign over that gate that closes because uh, if it rains and there's a lot of wind, I'd like to have that there to prevent the rain and everything coming in. Yeah, but it's coming along. So I'm estimating about three weeks I'll be open and I'll be shooting a video of the shop completed, ready to uh, open. So getting closer to the day, should be open in about a week. This project's taken about five weeks so far. Place was a mess. There'll be video of the previous condition of the place. I've got to get a curtain for the window so you can actually see the sign. I'm gonna get a yellow curtain for the back. Cleaners here, my cleaner Noel going to be a sign there and there'll be signs on the roof. Kitchen's almost ready to go. Freezer, small freezer, I've got to get another freezer here. Drainage is going to be done tomorrow and then we'll be ready to set up and get going. The counter's there, everything should be fine. I'm not sure where everything's going to go yet, but tiling and everything's done. I'm putting another exhaust fan in over the griller and uh, shelving will go somewhere with a lot of stuff on it. Another big freezer will go here behind the window. Drinks fridge I got fairly cheap, 10,000 baht. Their third own and a half new, that was second hand but only three weeks old. Some plants for outside here to make that a nice little area for eating. That table and chairs will go there. It'll be fairly cool out here. I'll put a fan on the stand out here. Um, put a fan on the stand outside. I've got this rotating fan up here. New LED lighting. Let's have a look at the uh, lighting. Fairly well lit area. At night time it's almost like daylight. Got uh, LED lighting. Got LED lighting here for night time. So pretty well lit. Yeah, got 
my lucky plan and got my restaurant and alcohol license all done so very close to opening very very close to opening yeah I'm happy with it not happy with the contractor because he hasn't been back for five days and I've had to get someone else who's more expensive cleaner's happy she's whispering something there to the boss boss you happy <laughs> my little temple up there I've got to go and buy a Buddha to put up on there and get the monks to come and bless the shop yeah so there it is the billabong The Billabong Aussie Diner. Uh, this is the shop from one side. It has two entries. As you can see, you can see right through the shop there. There's dining for uh, eight people out the front. There's dining for four people inside. Uh, you'll see that uh, I've retiled the whole thing, repainted it. You'll see what a mess it was when I uh, edit this video and put it on YouTube. The Billabong, Aussie Diner. Okay, this is the internal of the shop. Seating for four people. This is my most valued staff member, Pang, who's waiting patiently to serve some customers. Very smart girl and a good cook. And uh, knows how to do the burgers and the tacos and everything. By the time you get here, you'll be getting served exceptional food my support well, I couldn't have got through the last couple of weeks without M say hello. hello okay so the shop has two openings this is one side got some dining area out here as well and there's a bit of parking next door there got our drinks fridge here our counter which uh, you'll see there was a wall in here this was a tattoo studio there was a wall in here on this wall here which I have still got to do some decor on that was a, a full mirror that whole wall so uh, we've done our blessings on the shop and uh, hopefully that'll bring us some luck got overhead fans installed a bit of a storage area here, a couple of freezers for all our food stuffs, fridge for stuff that's been taken out of the freezer, have uh, our fry machine, our griller, our cleaning area, quite a compact little kitchen, but we are only doing burgers, tacos, uh, hot dogs and kebabs. So that's the shop, that's it. The Billabong Aussie Diner. Open now and uh, ready for business. Uh, thanks to my very good friend Rob. I've already got some Aussie decor and I've got some more that he gave me that's gotta go up on the wall yet. We'll get around to that shortly. So there you have the Billabong Aussie Diner there it is the Billabong Aussie Diner so if you're in Cha Arm bus station road you'll see it with the blue awning at the backside right next to the booty bar not far from the red line Ian and Mint's place and across the road from Cha Arm perfect house hotel and just a few steps up the road from Terry's Cha Cha Bar over there. 
So the Billabong, Aussie Diner, open, ready for business. I'll put this video last and uh, I'll do the progression of the shop from when I first opened the doors and had a look in here to what we've uh, made it now. So you're all welcome. Do yourselves a favour, get down here and have a burger when you're in Chatham. Ciao for now.